Hello and welcome back. Now in this, you can see that there is a host name and there is a port. And now if we move this uh, our uh, application into a different uh, website, say CNN or or Udemy or BBC, then we have to come here and hard code this. And uh, this will cause a problem if every time we relocate our uh, our project or our program and say we move our program into production as well this will pre uh, present the same problem so now we're going to use uh, relative URL instead so we will uh, ram out uh, the old URL in the action uh, of our form and in the new one we will uh, change the action to, to point to a relative URL instead so we will delete we delete all uh, all the code, all the host name, the port number, the HTTP bit, and we'll keep only query. And query, as you recall, refers to our query series servlet as we configured it in WebXML. And now we've eliminated the absolute URL and we're using a relative. So now if we run our form, let's run our form. As you can see, everything runs the same way. And uh, here you go. And let's uh, let's run it. Uh, let's close all these steps and uh, let's run it one more time to make sure we all uh, satisfied again. And as you can see, it's running again. So now, now let's drill down and go into Tomcat, where our uh, website is uh, hosted and where we've published it there. And as you can see. So this bit here, ebook shop. So all that area here, all the ebook shop and all the sub uh, folders are there. If we move that into any other web, any other uh, uh, host environment, any other website, or any, or we change the ISP provider or to production, say, um, do not have to hard code all this. All that code as a one block, we can move it. And our query will still work because it's referring to the context root of our project rather than the absolute URL. And uh, so we will not need to hard code any of these uh, port numbers or, or host name. Uh, rather, we'll use a relative URL. So now we will delete the, the old uh, the old uh, the old form, and we'll keep the relative URL for now. So we save our project. And that's all for now. So see you on the next uh, uh, clip. We'll talk about uh, multi-query servlet. Bye for now.